Item number, SCP-3949. Object class, neutralized. Special containment procedures. Foundation web crawler IONYSE is to monitor for post mentioning Penumbra Wave or its characters. Any flag posts are to be immediately reported to Mobile Task Force Omicron 5 true fans. MTF Omicron 5 is to determine if these posts originated from SCP-3949 and, if so, to respond to these posts until the SCP-3949 instance deletes itself. Description. SCP-3949 denotes a series of accounts, presumably all created by a single entity, located on various social media websites, forums, and message boards. All of SCP-3949's posts center around the non-existent animated series Penumbra Wave, or the fan community supposedly surrounding it. However, researchers have managed to extrapolate information about Penumbra Wave through SCP-3949's posts. According to these extrapolations, Penumbra Wave is in the sci-fi genre and had four seasons before going on indefinite hiatus. In-depth information can be found in Supplementary File 3949-R238. Attempts to trace the origin of SCP-3949 have so far proven unsuccessful. Approximately 2% of people who view SCP-3949's posts will become convinced that Penumbra Wave exists and that they have watched at least one episode of it. SCP-3949 has a very timid temperament and generally does not respond positively to negative comments or responses to its posts. In most cases, SCP-3949 will respond a few times with attempts to induce guilt in the responder before deleting itself and all its posts entirely. After this, SCP-3949 will reappear under a new username after a variable period ranging from 9 to 72 days. After Incident 3949-119, SCP-3949 has not created any new accounts. After one year of inactivity, SCP-3949 was reclassified neutralized. Incident Number 014 Post Content a digital artwork created by SCP-3949 depicting two characters, Iridium and Tabil, embracing. MTF response. Several comments noting the discrepancy in Iridium's skin color between the artwork, light brown, and the show, dark purple. Incident number 057. Post content. A reposted fanfiction by the user I'm a Porpoise 119 Work is 18 chapters long and primarily centers on an alternate ending into season 2 where the Kurong army never reached the Macarian Citadel, with a romantic subplot between two minor characters. MTF response. Comments critiquing the overall grammar, dialogue, extreme mischaracterization of King Ikaj, as well as several statements that the two romantic leads of the work have never shared screen time in the show. Incident number 066. Post content. A reposted uncredited artwork depicting one character wielding the storm sword and standing over a defeated foe. MTF response. Several extensive comments analyzing previous fight scenes and statistics, ultimately concluding that the losing character would have easily defeated the other, and that the winning character would be incapable of wielding the storm sword in the first place. Incident number 089. Post content. A video overlaying a non-existent song, My Angel, by Fireflight over a series of short clips of a climatic sword battle during Season 1, Episode 9. MTF response. Several comments criticizing the choice of song and suggesting that scenes from later seasons would have been more visually appealing. Incident number 119. Post content. A long 10,000 word post describing SCP-3949's personal life, experience while watching the show, and how the show has affected SCP-3949's life. MTF response. A single comment reading, no one cares.